and good morning and finally it's gonna happen we're gonna drive in today with motorbikes to oh my god that name memory on yeah now it's working yeah hoy anni hoy anni okay finally start <laughs> it takes about two weeks to get the bike because of weather and that's why because we're chasing our plans so many times but finally Hue to Hoi An and maybe even further let's see there is still coming that storm so we don't know sure what happens tomorrow but now we're gonna enjoy the little motorbike yeah yeah <laughs> Yep. Thank you. Yep. Ah, this is so much nicer bike. I've been driving the scooter so many years and now finally a little bit bigger. So much better to sit and ah, everything. One thing is uh, quite a bit different if you're comparing the if you drive a motorbike in Finland, we always going the left side if you want to pass some car or some motorbike. But here <laughs> total random. People even drive against you sometimes, so <laughs> you really have to check all the time in your mirror. But this in this moment this is not not so bad at all. This is actually very good weather and not so much traffic. It's very good driving today. Unbelievable good. But there is still like many many years ago when I driving last like manual bike. So just a little bit. Mm -hmm. Memory to my muscles again. No, it seems to wear and go well. <laughs> and our first destination is a uh, city of ghosts. It's the big cemetery. I'm not sure if that's uh, still working or it's like uh, old and not, nobody uses it anymore. But we are heading there. So we have to drive about one hour there. But these beers are so nice and I love to drive motorbikes. There was many years ago when I drive with a uh, non-automatic bike. But when I was younger I drive bikers very much. This is probably one of the weirdest places where I've been driving with motorbike. <laughs> Unbelievable! But, uh... So, this is the ghost city. And of course I don't remember the Vietnamese name, but this is unbelievable. And if I don't understand wrong, this is cemetery. But what the... Ha. Unbelievable. Definitely the weirdest place where I've been with my motorbike. <laughs> I don't see any info size side. Something about history. I think we are still using it because when we're driving in this way, they still like building here. A little bit far away in this way. Whoa, bumpy road! Whoa. the bike and go a little bit walking. Yeah. 
Yep. Definitely one of the weirdest places where I'd be with motorbike. But if you are really looking at these graves, these are quite young. This is 2002. 2022, I mean. <laughs> And we mostly this uh, cemetery are building with concrete. We first thought this building with like stone, but they don't. These are actually concrete, the old graves, but still very <laughs> epic. <laughs> Surprise, we don't have any like this in Finland. Oh, Ooh, what are buffalo? Like always, not enough the time, so we have to continue our trip in the next next sleeping place because here is come to dark probably a little bit over one hour, so we have to drive about one hour. So let's go again. I just waiting that island that part. There is supposed to be like very beautiful scenery and landscape and you can see the ocean and everything but I don't know. I just read just like a little bit in the internet about that part but I don't want to know too much. So I want to get surprised. Finally, about the middle way of our journey, and we finally are mostly the place. But also, this happens. Our track is <laughs> loose when we drive in one tunnel. There's sound like boom, and then we lost our bolt, so we have to trap it tight again. So let's gonna do it. Let's gonna hope this will fix it. Again, early morning and karaoke never sleeps you. <laughs> but yeah, let's pack it up and let's continue to driving again. And today we're supposed to be going to Hanoi. Hoi An. <laughs> some, someday, someday I will remember some names. <laughs> but yeah, let's pack it up and let's go. Checkout is done and we are back again and we try to find next something to eat. I think we're gonna find it in this road. Let's try that local bread again. <coughs> Thank you. Come on. Mmm, breakfast bread. 
it's funny because in Finland I can't eat a bread and not be the uh, whole Europe. But when I come to Asia, I can eat bread. Actually, Philippines, that mess my stomach. But I try here, I can eat bread in Vietnam and also in India. And I don't know why. But Finland, no. Absolutely not. Mm. So good. And this is like mm, local bread, morning breakfast bread. Uh, young me, if I pronounce that right, probably not. But yeah, uh, super awesome. And super cheap also. This cost mm, 10 Vietnamese dollars, 10,000, I mean, and 25 is 1 euro, so this cost 150 cents, 40 cents. <laughs> ah, too bad, too. Awesome day to drive. Ah. And also super green. We're gonna drive about two or three hours today to Hoi An, but probably it's gonna take so much longer because I will stop and see the landscape again. This moment, unbelievable beautiful. <laughs> okay, let's, let's take a best shot and let's try. Okay, let's just follow other people. <laughs> Maybe here. In this moment, Google Maps, uh, look, we are driving two roads at the same time. <laughs> Doesn't matter if we can turn left some far. Oh, now I know, I understand. We are totally wrong for roads because we probably should in that road. Yep. Yep. We are in the wrong road. Fuck a look, check a look. Don't know, check it out. Bah. Okay, now I get it. We have to take a U-turn. Google Maps doesn't go uh, right uh, roads because these roads are like 
very close to each other. So that's why it looks so crazy. Ooh, the landscape again. <laughs> Okay, little coffee break, because it's still boarding. But this coffee have a very cool looking landscape. And beer point, and actually there is one beer point about 300 meters in that way. There is supposed to be like one beer point, but you can't stop there anywhere, because it's so curved all the time. And also that TV series Top Gear, they are also driving this high band road once and there is actually also like top gear rear point but still you can't stop your car or your motorbike there because it's so curved all the time. But next let's taste some coffee and enjoy the landscape. Okay let's do history and let's drink some coffee this is very rare. <laughs> But these Vietnamese coffees are incredibly good. This is salty caramel cold coffee. Yeah, it still tastes a little bit coffee, but these are very different what we have in Finland. Probably that's why I drink this a little bit. And this is probably is the best part of this high one path because you can see some epic views soon. We are so lucky because they are doing some road renovation here. So very lucky because most of the time this asphalt is very good shape. There is a couple of parts where it feel like old asphalt and it's horrible shape. <laughs> but now it's very good driving. This looks so incredible. Because coming down in the mountains and we see like big city. <laughs> First time to see it. Okay, back a little bit bigger city, Dung Huang, if I don't remember wrong, probably I don't remember wrong, but, but this is a little bit more hectic. <laughs> but luckily we have a plan, we go in the coastline very soon, it's supposed to be 
Getting right up all now. Ah! Three hours later. Okay, this is changing our plans to raining start. Uh, five hours before what's the winter app say. So, next we try to wait a little bit. It's over, but next we are gonna return to bike. That means we have to drive one hour maybe in the rain, but no can do. So, let's pack it in and let's go. Yep, it was a little bit very dry here, the Hoi An. But later today, we're gonna eat some food in the old garters because there is no training so much anymore. So, next there. We finally get ourselves to Hoi An, the city of thousand letters and the street food. But the heavy rains finally cuts us and every place is started floating. So we change after city, after city, after city. But the rain just following us to the border of the Ho Chi Minh. But yeah, thanks for watching this video and let's see you in the next week. Bye! That's scary. Let's hope nobody gets hurt. Ooh, ooh. Well. Okay, there is go electrics. So, Asia finally got me. I've been sick now. <laughs>